Hello folks, Happy New Year. Uh, I've been doing a bit of bass fishing over the last month. Um, I had a bit, a bit of a dry spell at the start of the month, but uh, I have had a few recently, including today. Uh, so I've had my first bass of the year, it's New Year's Day today, so it's a nice one to get out of the way. So I've put a few clips together, and um, not too much of the unsuccessful trips, so I don't want to bore you to death. Uh, but uh, hopefully you'll enjoy. No joy last night, very disappointing. It looked alright. Just no bass around, sometimes they're not around. So, um, um, coming out again this morning. Got to take advantage of some of the daylight hours we've got. So, the sun hasn't come up yet, but um, it's not far away. Just going to do a couple of hours, use the crazy sand eel again. Hopefully, it'll, uh, it'll do its magic. Oh, I couldn't believe it when I got out of the car. I thought. It was freezing. All right, it sounds like Richard's got a bass. So I missed it. Just saw him lifted up out of the water. Didn't look huge, but it's bigger than any bass I've caught today, that's for sure. Let's kind of have a look. The bass, yeah. On the pachinko. Cool. It was quite a lot bigger. Yeah. It was um, coming inside. <laughs> it was in its mouth and also on its gills. Uh, cool. Do you want to give it a show to the camera? Ah, that's a nice little bass. Cool. Well, it's still a bass. <laughs> right, well I'm gonna come and steal your spot then. Actually it's quite not bad here, eh? So you've got more you've got quite a wide range you can fish around. <laughs> I'm getting nervous now the camera's on you. Ah <laughs> oh, you could do it, no problem there Richard. There you go, opportunity, way. <laughs> oh, how disappointing. <laughs> right, so hopefully the wind noise isn't too bad. It's uh, late December. I have had rubbish luck recently with, with batting. But well, I'm determined to catch one in December, so um, I've come out, it's about an hour before it gets dark. It's just coming up to low water and um, I've come out to this sort of shallow area where there's, um, there's some fast uh, running tide. So uh, it, it should, it looks perfect. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll give it a go. It's a fairly big tide. Just got to make sure I'll be able to get back and don't get cut off. So um, yeah. It's going to get dark, so I'm going to I'll film it as best as I can. I have got a light with me um, if I do catch anything, but um, yeah, let's hope I get something. Right, I found a, a spot where I'm a bit sheltered, but it's not ideal. There's a pot out there. Um, and there's not much room to manoeuvre, but let's give it a couple of chucks here. Right, let's try something different. No good sticking with the same thing if it don't work. So, I think I'll change. Change over. And... I think I'm gonna go with... Oh, I've got, I've got a new lure, actually. That came through the post. Got it from Mr. Fish. So like Oh no. Yeah, I've got my zonk, but there's no way I'm risking it in here. I have got a bright green JJ Minnow. 
it's a pays bass jj minnow really cool they've got this um this head this sort of like um detached head which wobbles from side to side it's got really realistic looking gills as well so uh give it a go <laughs> i've just literally just hooked into a bass literally on the just followed me up on the jj minnow there you can see rich rich Oh, it's not very big, <laughs> but it's a bass. <laughs> I literally saw it take it. I didn't have the camera on for the first time. Unbelievable. There we go. <laughs> literally only a tiddler. Right, it's 40 centimeters. So it's uh, certainly not the biggest bass in the world, but it's the first bass I've caught in a little while, so I'll take it. Right, let's get him back. Right, so I was going to try and get an underwater shot, but it's so difficult from up here. I'm perched right up on the rock here. So it's a shame you didn't get to see it. The, the bass actually take the lure. I actually watched it take it. So there we are. Nice little bass, just as it's getting dark. 40 centimetres. Must only be about, I don't know, pound and a bit. Right, let's get him back in. And away he goes. All right, let's see if I can get another one. See a tiddler, tiddler again. Again, right in close. Ah, oh, there we are. Nice little pass. He's smaller than the last one. Let's have a look at you. On the JJ Minnow again. He's a tiddly bass, this one. Let's have a look at the light on. There we go. Nice little bass, though. It's always nice to catch a bass. So, yeah, nice lip, lip hooked again. So let's just get that out. Right. Let me give you a better show. But, uh, yeah. It's starting to get dark now. There seem to be a few little schooly bass around. One second. Let's give you a better show. All right, well, I have gone a little while without catching a bass. So even though it's a tiny little bass, in fact, I will measure him just, <laughs> just to prove how tiny he is. And he can't be any more than 35 centimeters. I'm not gonna bother. It's about 35 centimeters I reckon but it's still nice to catch all the same again followed it right the way in it took it right at the last minute so uh yeah lovely I'll take that right see if I can get one that's slightly bigger Uh, yeah, it's a little bass. Still a bass, Rich. There we go. Well, the bass are here. Nice little bass. All right, Rich is into another fish showing me up on New Year's Eve. Any good or is this a little one? <laughs> oh, well. It's alright, about the same size, eh? Yeah. Bridge is showing me up again. See if it's fighting a bit more now? Here it comes. Looks all right, Rich.
That's all right. It's a nice slow pass. Bigger than ones yesterday. Oh, I've got to find myself one now. I can't not catch today now, Richard. What? Oh, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, I'm in. Uh, towards Chue Headland. It's not. It's nothing big. It's, 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 I hooked into it right out there. I think you can see it on the surface out there. Look. Yeah, it's coming in on the surface. He's certainly not very big, that's for sure. Here it comes. Yep, first bass of the year. First bass on my new rod. Uh, so I swallowed it right down by the look of it. First bass of the year. Forty one, no, forty two, I'd say. Forty two centimeters, so. Nice little bass to start the year. Right, let's get him unhooked. There we go. Nice little bass. Forty two centimeters, so, um, yeah, not too bad. Just under a two pound. Put him back. Oh, there you go. Where I was fishing on New Year's Day, uh, the tide's quite a lot higher than it was when I, the day I was fishing. This was taken early on in the year, but it's quite rough ground as you can see, and uh, there's a causeway which goes out to the rocks in the distance. And there's a lot of tide which runs through there, and I'm, I'm sure the bass are waiting on the other side to pick anything up that comes through. Okay, I just thought I'd show you the lure that I've caught the bass on in this video. It's a Pays JJ Minnow um, candy green coloured lure. You can see it's a soft plastic with a, 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 a weighted head, and you can see it's got a jointed head actually. It's got quite realistic looking gills there. Um, the head's 17 grams, altogether the, the lure is uh, just under 30 grams. Um, and you can see the hook is hidden, so it's good for going through rough ground. And it's got a paddle tail on the end, so it gives quite good action. Casts really well, um, and um, yeah, I haven't had it snag at all, so yeah, it's pretty good. I haven't, obviously haven't caught anything huge on it yet, but um, yeah, I've been pretty impressed with it so far. Okay, so hopefully you enjoyed the video. As you can see, none of the bass are particularly large. Um, that's my aim really, is to catch a decent bass over the next couple of months. I've got myself a new rod. I've got a pen conflict inshore rod with a faster action, so I'll be able to work the top uh, water lures a little bit better. I'm desperate to catch something decent on the top water lures. Uh, yeah, so if you like the video, then please click on the like button and feel free to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of this.